Hey guys, this is Zavin from DNC. Now, in this video, I'll be sharing with you how you can change the zoom background to a solid color. You can choose any color that you want, or even if you are having your corporate color, you can use your corporate color as your solid color background as well. So let's go into our step-by-step -step sharing. Now, basically, to change your virtual background to a solid color, um, it's very easy. Okay, currently, if you're looking at my screens, right, I yet to turn on my camera. So, the picture that you're looking at over right here, this is basically my profile picture. Okay, my Zoom profile picture. So, if you can see, uh, when the moment that I join to the participants, on the left-hand side beside my name, there will be my profile picture. Right, so uh, yeah, so if you want to know how to change the profile picture in Zoom, okay, you can check out on my other videos, right? So you can't change it over right here, okay? You can't change it uh, after you join into a meeting, yeah? So you can only do it uh, in your Zoom account, okay? So you can check out my other video that I mentioned about this, okay? So right now, I'm going to focus on your virtual background. So currently, if you can see, if I turn on my cameras, right, my virtual backgrounds right now is at my current location, okay? I didn't set any virtual backgrounds yet, okay? However, if you would like to change your virtual background, this is where you can go, okay? You can just click here and go under the virtual backgrounds, okay? Um, over right here, the default is that you can use all these different photos and graphic um, as your virtual backgrounds. However, for those of you if you don't like uh, you know, the pictures, the photos format, and you would like to have a very plain um, color, a solid color background um, as your virtual background, how do you do that? Yeah? Uh, currently, over right here, there's no setting for you to set that. Okay, There's no color chart um, that you can surely pick the color and uh, change the current backgrounds. No, you can't do that. Okay. However, as an example, right, I can actually change it to a solid black color background like this. Yeah. How do you do that? First of all, I will just close my setting first. Okay. And I will off my camera as well. Yeah. So uh, why do I off my camera? Reason behind is that actually, um, I usually I will change my background before I turn on my camera, okay? Or else, what will happen is that when the moment that I'm turning on my camera, if there are other participants in the same Zoom meeting, um, they will be, you know, they will be looking at me live, changing my background. So it doesn't look that professional in a way, yeah? So usually, um, I will off my camera, then only I will change my backgrounds, uh, then right after that, I will turn on my camera again one more time. Okay, so um, yeah, coming back to the topic, um, how do you change the color backgrounds? Yeah, so solid color background. First of all, like I mentioned, you can't do it. Uh, there's no color plate for you to do it in the Zoom setting. So uh, we actually need to go and download an image. Okay, uh, download a color background as an image. So uh, we will go to Google, Google image, right? So let's say I would like to change it to a yellow color background. So I will search yellow color background, okay? So then I will go under the Google image, right? So over right here, if you can see, um, I can choose, you know, depends on what kind of color that, what kind of backgrounds that you want. So this is still considered as like, you know, a design background. Um, but if you really, really want a super solid color, you can go with like, you know, solid color like this, yeah? So you can change the uh, keyword to yellow solid color background, yeah? So in my case, let's say I want to um, get this as my background. So what do you do is that you need to save this as an image, right? To your laptop or your mobile phone, yeah? Same thing, okay? So I'll go with yellow background. Um, I will show a few backgrounds color so you can see the, you know, the changes right there, yeah? So maybe the other one I will go with pink color okay the pink color background let's say 
a slightly lighter pink color. All right. Okay, so then I'll save this image pink, pink color, pink background. Ah. And then one more, maybe I will go with a blue color background. All right, so maybe I will just go with this one. Ah, this is not a solid, solid color. So maybe I will go with... Uh, let me just change my keyword. Okay, I like light blue. Ah, maybe this one. Okay, this one. I will just choose this one as my blue color background. So I will just come here, blue background. All right. Okay, so that's it. So once you get all the colors that you want, right now, you will need to come back to your Zoom, right? And we are going to go under the uh, edit, right? So I'm going to go under the change the virtual background again. And then right now, I'm going to select the image, right? So I'm going to add the image and then I'm going to uh, upload all the color background image that I um, you know, I selected earlier, I downloaded the image from Google. So my blue color, and then I have my yellow color as well. All right. Okay. So uh, right now, I'm going to turn on my camera. And you can see from the backgrounds right here. So if you can see, currently, um, this is the color that I choose, yellow. So if you don't want, you can just come here and you can just change it to other color. Yeah. So you observe here. Yeah? So this is the this is the background. Okay, so I will just go with pink color. And blue color is life changing. Okay, it's life changing whenever that I turn on the camera. So if you want, you know, a solid color as your background, uh, this is basically how you do, right? So uh pretty much very, very simple. This is uh in this video that I would like to share with you. Okay, so for those of you, if you are looking at uh steps and uh, how to actually change your zoom background to a solid color. Um, basically, uh, this is how you should do it, okay? You just need to download a solid background, color background, and you can just interchange a different color that you want, right? So uh, basically, that's all in this video that I would like to share with you. Now, if you have successfully changed your background to a solid color that you want, you can leave a comment below and let me know, all right? And uh, if you like our video, Remember to help us like and share. And I will see you in the next video. Thank you for watching. If you like our video, remember to leave your comment below. Help us like and share. If you are yet to subscribe to our YouTube channel, remember to click on the subscribe button and most importantly, hit on the bell icon so that you'll be able to receive notifications when we launch our new video. See you in the next video.